Hi everyone, it's me again. Hiya, happy Christmas. I'm doing a Christmas special and I'm going to be assisted by my 10 year old niece, Georgiana. Come and say hello. hello. That's Georgiana. We'll be seeing a bit more of her later because she's cooked one of these mince pies. What I've got here is a Tesco mince pie, a Morrison's mince pie, an Asda mince pie and one of Georgiana's mince pies that she's made the pastry herself and she's made the filling herself. So I'm going to do a blind testing. I'm going to be blindfolded. Georgiana is going to pass me the mince pies one at a time and not tell me which is which. And I'm going to give my verdict. Now, I don't claim to be a professional. Never have. But I do like mince pies. So I'm going to have to keep my palate clean. So I have, I've got some more local ales from the colder, from the Little Valley Brewery. I've got a dark veil. But it reads like poetry this. Listen to this. The Journey. Dark Veil vale Vanilla Porter invites you to explore a full landscape of flavour at your own pace. Feel free to stroll the gentle slopes of rich dark textures and pass by subtle hints of vanilla and licorice. It reads like Bronte, doesn't it? That? Right. I've got a more ale. The Journey. More ale takes you on a tour of rural Yorkshire through the medium of a red-brown ale. Smoky flavours and hints of moorland heather combined for an unforgettable full-blooded, full-blooded, full-blooded taste. Or full-blooded taste, it's up to you, you decide. Um, yeah, <clears throat> so, is that one. And lastly, Hebden's Wheat. Now, you know I'm partial to a wheat beer because I did a special on it, didn't there, a week or two ago. But this one is <clears throat> The Journey, it says The Journey. Hebden's wheat takes you one sip beyond the traditional Belgian wheat beer. Ramble through fruity flavours. Savour hints of lemon, coriander and arrive at pure refreshment. Pure refreshment. Not just refreshment. Pure, re pure refreshment, Georgiana. <laughs> Is that the sort of refreshment you like? Yeah. See? Dennis. She's ten, she knows. Right, so what I'm going to do, sort myself some kind of blindfold out. I might just put this hat over my eyes, I'm not sure yet. Pour myself a beer, for, that's more important. Then we're going to do the tasting and I'll tell you what I think. And as you know, um, completely impartial. Whatever's the nicest pie will be the nicest pie. Oops, she's going for it. Right, <laughs> I'll speak to you very, very shortly. Right, I'm back. As you can see, I'm wearing a blindfold and I can't see anything. I poured myself a beer. which is very nice. Now, in no particular order, Georgiana is going to pass me a mince pie. Aren't you, Georgiana? Yes. First one. Don't tell me where it's from. You've got to remember where it's from, though. Mm. So take the little label off and put it at the yep, somewhere. Yeah, done it. Right. That's all right. I'm just um, a bit squeezing my nose, my mask, and I couldn't taste anything. Well, maybe there's no taste. Or well, maybe I've got COVID. That's all right. It's um, that's just a very pedestrian run of the mill mince pie. If someone gave it, you'd eat it. You'd think, I wish I had a bit of cream, it's a bit dry, but it's not the end of the world. It's a mince pie. Right, another drink. I've got to refresh my palate. Ready for the next one. Yeah, um, the same one. Yeah, can you pull a bit more of the um, which one is it? It's the more ale. <laughs> Give me more ale. More ale serving wench. All these fireworks going up outside. Someone celebrating Christmas. Is that there somewhere? Yeah. Right, okay, I'll need another mince pie as well. The second mince pie. So the first one was all right. Nothing up with it as such. Mm. That's interesting. The pastry is a bit crisp on the outside. But when you get into it, 
it's like the fruit's caramelised a bit. Really sweet. A bit boozy. I like booze. Mmm. No, you wouldn't be disappointed with that one. That's a very good one, that. That's not the top of my list so far. You ready for your next one? No, I'm still eating this one. Don't rush me. Come on. <laughs> no, you get another assistant if you keep, you know. Yeah, we've got to open another bottle, aren't we? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm standing back for this. Secret Santa got me this bottle opener. Oh, it worked. Do you want to um, pass me a mince pie so while you're pouring it, I can be eating a mince pie? Right then, here we go again. Bit of weight to this one. You want to know what kind of beer? Yeah, what kind of beer am I drinking? Dark Vale. Dark Vale. The based in Crag Vale is brewery. Excuse me. And I read a book not long ago about the Crag the Crag Vale coiners. And they used to um get coins off everyone and shave the edges off them for the silver of bake more and they nearly brought the british financial economy down to the knees so i um, they caught with hung them you just got a mince pie crumb in your bin mm. have i that's, yeah. like, <laughs> that's like eating dust that oh have you seen them videos where people put a spoonful of cinnamon in their mouth that's what i feel mm. just happened oh, you can't eat that not without cream Ice cream or custard. We'll put it there for now. Now that was just like dust. There's lumps in it. Is that a mince pie? Yeah. Right. It's my fault. Ugh, right. One more mince pie. Some more beer. I'll need more beer if it's like the last one. Last that let me way through a desert. <laughs> no, that's my hand. Try not to eat your thumb. Hopefully, this one will blow me away because so far only one of them has been any good. <laughs> You've got a big lump of mince pie in there. This one. I mean, I've made a mess. You're in charge. <laughs> no, when you eat them. It's your kitchen, not mine. Good point. That's all right. Mm. Right, I'm going to rank these. The best one was number two. Okay. Followed by number one. Followed by number four. Okay, hold on. Followed by number three. So I'm going to take the mask off now. I'll have number four, please. Yeah. If you don't want it. There you go. Oh, it's bright in here. <laughs> How did we do? So we came first. Was that yours? Then it was... Oh. Morrison's. Then it, it was Morrison's. Only that one goes on the wind. Yeah. Then it was Morrison's. Yeah. That one. Which one was that one? The, the bad one. That one. As the, the dust... Excuse me, Bob. And choking me to. <laughs> the Asda one was terrible. I mean, it's Christmas Day now, so you're not going to be out buying mince pies, are you? Eesh. But maybe next year, you just Looks think. It's dusty. It is dusty. No. Don't get Asda. If you do, make sure you've got plenty of moist stuff. No. Hopefully, no. If you want real mince pies, get around Georgiana's house. She'll bake you some. But, but they're not cheap, are they? No. How much are they? £20 per. £20 per buy, but they're worth it. For two. Oh, for two, you get two for that. Right, thanks for watching. And um, join me again tomorrow where I'll, I'll be eating some Boxing Day pies. 
Thank you. Bye.